Hello everyone. Thanks for joining me. Today I am going to be making some cabbage soup. My sister came up and this is what she requested me to make. So here we go. We're going to start off by chopping up some cabbage. And there it is. And then after that's all chopped up, we're, we're going to get a very large pan and put in two cans of diced tomatoes. Some of you might recognize those from the uh, senior food commodity box. They are the no salt added. And then next we are going to add a large can of crushed tomatoes. This is the basil flavored crushed tomatoes. And we're going to go ahead and scrape out the paint, uh, can because, you know, sometimes when you just dump it, it doesn't all go in there. And then we are going to add in our recently chopped cabbage. You can chop that in any which way, size or whatever, how you like it. Um, and all the flavors of the soup is just, you know, put in whatever flavors you want, however you want it to taste. This is a easily personalized soup. It's extremely hearty and is low calorie. So after we get all that in there, we are going to put in some seasoning. I love this basil, oregano, um, and salt and pepper seasoning from McCormick. It is my favorite. And then we are going to add some salt, extra salt. And then we're going to cover it and put it on medium heat. Meanwhile, we are going to chop some carrots. And there we go. And then we are going to add those to our, our pan that you can see it's already nice and steamy. It's already starting to cook up really nicely. And give that a quick stir. It's already looking really delicious. Make sure that um, you get all the seasoning stirred in real good and all the tomatoes and everything stirred in real good. Cover it back up, still on medium heat. Now we are going to chop a onion, a red pepper, and two poblano peppers. And there we go. So then we are just going to now throw that into our pan and it's still just on the medium heat as we're just doing all of our vegetables and getting them in there. I really do enjoy cabbage soup as well. It is uh, very delicious in my opinion. Of course, I mean, I, I like all the food I cook, the majority of it anyway. So now we're just going to make sure we get all that stirred in um, together, still on medium heat. And now we are going to just uh, chop up some three ribs of celery. And we are also going to chop up the celery leaves as well. I believe that the celery leaves gives it a lot of flavor when you put it inside of a soup. Now we're just going to put all that in there. And give it a quick stir. It's coming together really nicely. The whole house is smelling like this delicious soup. And then we are going to put it on low heat. So I got to move my pan over to a smaller burner. There we go. And then now we are going to put in a box of this vegetable broth. Give it a little bit more broth inside of this soup. Give it a quick stir. Now it's just going to be on low heat and we are going to cook that probably for about an hour to two hours until all the vegetables 
are nice and tender, casing it along the way to add any extra um, flavorings that you would like to add in there. And here we go, let's give it a taste test. You can see that, you know, all the different vegetables on, on my spoon there. I'm sitting there, I'm talking to my mom and my sister. We're all gonna enjoy some of this soup and like it's so hot I had to blow on it for like 10 minutes before I could even put it in my mouth. And yeah, I didn't give it a thumbs up yet, but it's gonna be a thumbs up and then my sister's gonna come in here and she's gonna give me a thumbs up too and then my mom's gonna give it a thumbs up as well. We all really enjoyed this soup. It's it's very delicious, and it's only, um, I can't remember how many calories it is, but I will add a little card here that shows, like, the calories and whatnot. If you made it this far with me, just, just know how much I appreciate you and being a subscriber and watching my videos. Um, thank you to all my brand new subscribers. I'm almost at 750 and that is really exciting for me. I hope you enjoyed me making this soup and um, watching just all my videos that I create. I know I'm not the best, um, but I'm just doing this to have fun and cook food and I cook anyway, so might as well record it. Anyways, that's my sister. And my mom is on this other side. She's going to give her thumbs up also. Uh, she, she didn't reach quite far enough. Anyways, thank you everybody. I hope you enjoyed my video. Like and subscribe.